There's a rumor that glass hurled by a tornado can decapitate a person. To test it, Tori built a simulated neck from pig cervical vertebrae and designed experiments based on the wind speeds associated with different storm categories. Their initial plan was to mount a pane of glass on a frame in the bed of a pickup truck and use the truck's acceleration to approximate tornado force wind. Because the pickup couldn't reach true tornado speeds, they calculated that, by changing the glass's mass, hitting 80 miles per hour would mimic the effect of a Category 2 tornado. They put the fake neck by the roadside and drove the truck at 80 miles per hour. The moment the glass struck the neck, it cleanly sliced through. The cut was quick and precise, a result they traced back to the glass's thickness, combined with the vehicle's high kinetic energy, which skewed the test. To get closer to real-world conditions, they ran a second test using smaller glass pieces and built a launcher. Two motor-driven wheels spinning at high speed to fling shards at tornado-like velocities. When they fired the launcher, a shard hit the target at about 70 miles per hour and split the neck in two instantly. They repeated the test with ordinary window glass from the market and saw the same outcome. Based on wind speeds typical of EF4 to EF5 tornadoes, if a piece of glass is blown free and strikes someone, it really could sever a human neck. The takeaway, don't stay outside during a tornado. Find a safe shelter. The rumor was confirmed.